Now, Vietnam is one of the world's top four countries for shoe manufacturing. Much of that is down to factories pumping out pairs for big brands like Nike and Adidas. But a fashion revival means some shoemakers are putting their hearts and souls into a revolutionary design. A new trend is gaining traction. Rubber sandals like these ones are becoming fashionable again. The sandals were first made in the 1940s during the Indochina War against the French. They were crafted from ambushed military truck tires. Today, they're made in a variety of styles to appeal to a much wider audience. We want the rubber sandals to become part of our heritage. They're one of the unique products of Vietnam, and foreigners will mention them when they're visiting our country. The sandals were popularized by former revolutionary leader Ho Chi Minh and by Viet Cong soldiers during the Vietnam War. They became a symbol of the communist state's resourcefulness during wartime. Now, during peacetime, they've come to represent sustainable design and reducing one's carbon footprint. I myself prefer handmade sandals because they're cheaper. We can use old tires to make the rubber sandals. Of course, we could just as easily make rubber sandals from new rubber, but then the price would be much higher. Back in Tian Quan's Hanoi shop, a pair sells for around 10 euro. His brand has sold more than half a million pairs since he took over his father-in-law's business 11 years ago. For a small young company, that's quite a feat.